What's going on, everyone? Tuesday, February 27th, 2024. I'm out here at a local track. Uh, while I try to use all kinds of exercise to get my mind right, it is running that many years ago got me on this journey of trying to better myself and I've always been running since I was a kid uh, it's just been a while since I've done it um, so I'm here just trying to get back into it see how I feel I've been walking a lot lately and uh I'm just gonna see how this goes with the running again. See how my knees feel, see how my legs feel, see how my cardio feels. And uh, we'll see how it goes. I'm just about one lap in, quarter mile. I'm gonna go till it gets dark or it starts raining, one or the other, or I just completely crap out. I think what I'm gonna do is walk half mile, run half mile, and see how that goes. Back in 2015, I did a half marathon and if you go back on this channel you can sort of see the results of how that went and after that I kind of stopped running altogether I mean I dabbled a little bit here and there since then but uh, haven't really been consistent with it and my intent is to at least make it a regular part of my routine and my life because uh, I do have some plans in the future that some goals I'd like to attain that I'm not ready to announce yet. Half mile walking done. I'm about to start my half mile run. Stand by. We'll see how this goes. <laughs> okay. First complete mile done. First half mile run done. Uh... Not awful, but not great either. I think as I continue to run, I'll uh, start to work out some of the kinks and stuff, but, oh, my legs feel very heavy, very heavy. Running does not feel natural right now, like it has for most of my life. I think I'm gonna change my strategy up here and do quarter mile intervals instead of half mile, mile intervals. I think it's gonna help my legs to be uh, running every uh, every quarter mile. And who knows, if, they, if I start like uh, breaking myself in a little, I feel all right, maybe I'll just keep running. I know that's how it works with me, or in the past anyways. It takes me about a mile, mile and a half to get completely warmed up. So what I was saying before, I guess I'll just go ahead and put it out there. Uh, about future goals. So I'm 46. By the time I'm 50, I wanna complete an ultra marathon. Uh, Firstly, I guess would be a 50 miler, but uh, ultimately I want to complete a 100 miler. And I haven't, you know, thought through enough of what exactly that will be. Uh, so I don't necessarily like doing organized events. So we'll see. Uh, so, yeah, so if I'm. I've been telling myself this for, for a while now, and then, you know, 46, is gonna be 47 in a few months, so the clock is winding down. I gotta start getting back into it. And <laughs> based on how it's going right now, I got a long way to go. But uh, it's something to work for, something to work towards. Two miles down, 
I suspect my legs are getting warmed up. But my pacing and my cardio suck bad. Really bad. So those are things I'm gonna have to work on. It's getting pretty dark out here. I'm just gonna see see how it goes with the with the light situation here. Alright. I think I'm gonna call it from after I turn the camera off from the last clip. Uh, I just ran a mile and say an eighth we'll call it. Uh, so I've done three and a quarter. Uh, just doing one more cool down lap walking will be three and a half. It's getting dark. It might not look like it on the camera, but it's pretty dark out here. And uh, I got all the data I need. <laughs> I for sure have a long way to go. Like I was saying, pacing is off, cardio's off. Leg strength is off, but not as bad. It comes around after a warm up. It will be better when I can get out here on like a weekend with more daylight and just uh, just kind of push myself a little more, see what I can do. So yeah, that's it. Join me on my journey back into running. Watch me struggle like I do with most every workout video on this channel. And uh, I'll see you tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.